Hey everybody, guess what time it is? It's Bear of the Weekend time! Hello ladies! Just a handsome woodsman here. Had to come in from chopping lumber and take a break with my puppy. Handsome looking puppy. It's time for Bear of the Weekend. I'm going to try to make this short because my uh, camera has been messing up. If I record over too long, the video gets corrupted. So, where are you going? Get over here. So, it's been a long weekend slash week. I had to, today is Sunday. I had to uh, work Saturday and Sunday this weekend. Don't doesn't happen often, but I had to do that today. So, uh, came home, worked on a uh, mudroom bench we're working on. That's a video project. Be looking forward to it. All right, what do we have here? We have, this is another one from my uncle. Okay, Jolly Woodsman Coffee Stout, thus the attire, Jolly Woodsman. Blanded, banded horn, 7.5% alcohol volume, one pint. Okay, made with speckled axe Kenyan espresso, domestic pale malt, English black chocolate, and roasted malts, summit in centennial hops, Sacco River water yeast. Do, do, do. The Jolly Woodsman is a special blend of Norwild and Mountain. Our two stouts after blending. Hang on. Hey, come here. Quit doing that. Come here. Come here. Come here. That's it. You're making too much noise. Stay. Okay, where were we? After blending, we steep a bountiful amount of wood roasted Kenyan espresso from speckled axe. Fuels the most voracious of fires or the most ardent woodsman. Ardent woodsman? I don't know. Where's this made out of? Maine. Bitterford, Maine. All right, let's get on with the video. With a rowdy puppy who's chewing on a bottle. Give me this. Give me that. All right, on with the review. Oh, goodness. Smells wise, smells like a stout. Smells pretty good, 7.5. This should get us jolly, make us a jolly woodsman. All right, pretty good after a long week. Of course, I gotta start over again tomorrow. All right, so this is a coffee stout. Uh, the last one we had, I think, was a was it a milk stout? Might have been a milk stout. Uh, I think I like the other one better. But this is pretty good. This is a good one. I'll show you the can when we're done. It's got plaid on it. That's the plaid. Woodsman attire. As I was saying, after a long weekend, this hits the spot. Came home and worked on that bench for a little bit, fixing to make some hamburgers before the sun goes down. Of course, it's after daylight savings time, 
so the sun goes down quite early now. Uh, this is actually quite pleasant outside. Um, it was pretty cold last week and like down to 17 degrees I think for the cold cold. Uh, right now it's not too bad so I'm going to enjoy it while I can. On to the beer. Not bad. Not my favorite. I could have another one of these though. Definitely manly. So if you're looking for a manly beer, if you're tired of your watered down Bud Lights and looking for something more manly like a Heffenweizen or a coffee stout, try this out. You know who you are. Try this out. This will definitely put some hair on your chest. If you know what I'm talking about. You got hair on your chest? Not as much as Sadie. Okay. Have a good rest of your weekend. Review, I'll give this a, out of coffee stouts, I will give this a seven. Possibly eight. Okay, that's not a bad rating. It's just not a, my perfect beer. Over and out. Dumped all.